Well, hi everybody. Hope everyone is doing on well and great. Actually, my name is Vela Shaita Fresh Girl, Counselor, Youth Ambassador, and CEO to your vice. Today, whenever I see me like this, it means I have a lot to say and I have a lot of information that I want to share with you right now. And by before, let me just thank everybody who is fasting that Ramadan Karim to whoever is a Muslim and you know you're fasting. You know, God is always the first and knows our great and knows us so much. So what well, a great thank you for the fasting. Well, that's not the point that right brought me today to tell you, but I have only one important thing that I want to share it to you is that um, it's actually about that the organization, yes, well, the organization of vice, which is uh, for the youth. It's not only for me, but it's for everybody, for the youth. And it has been a while when we all quiet. I could not say about anything about it. I could not do any, or I could not take any any step about it. It's just because I was I wanted to get the international license, of which it went, it required me to be in Uganda, of which I haven't gone there yet. I don't even know when exactly I'm to go. But yes, I have that point of when I will go. Yes, I'll go. But Today, I just want to make it clear that because uh, I've got so many friends who are asking me about the job opportunities, who are telling me that what can we do if, uh, if, I, if I'm part of the organization, what's my role, what could I do? And you don't say anything about us. Well, this is what you should know about the job opportunities is that it's not me who's giving jobs. It's not me who is giving jobs, but I have people who are helping me on this. Let's say companies who are doing in job opportunities, who are helping girls and boys to work abroad on where you feel like, according to your choice, according to the to according to the job you apply for. So it's not me who is giving jobs. Actually, I'm just helping. I'm just helping to reach those those youth who are like, I really wanna work. I really wanna do this. I really wanna do this. And I'm talking more about the job opportunities because this is life. If you don't work, then it means that it's like you're buried alive. If you don't work, everyone has to work because that's uh, why God helped us to. We have to do that. But secondly, it's, uh, the, the organization is not only about the job opportunities, but also the helping, counseling, and charity. And my point today was about charity. That was the main, main reason as to why I'm making this video to everybody. It's not about the job opportunities, but it's about charity today. I'm looking for the trustworthy people who I can work with so that uh, they could help me on charity. Let's say helping the needy more so in, in, uh, in Uganda and any other countries if you're part of my organization and you wish you want to be part of and you're in a ugandan you're welcome i have no problem with that and i'm just grateful i'm very thankful to you i thank you so much for joining me there so i just wanted to give some small small things to the people who really need it let's say books to these kids let's say pains let's say sugar let's say bread let's say some clothes shoes uh, bags and some simple things like things like that i just wanted to give to these people who need it some people because they don't really need our money money is is is, is not not everybody has money even i myself i don't have it but i just feel like helping those who we can't get that what I'm getting you get and if you're out there and you want to be part of me and you want to help those people please join me I just beg you please join me because I just do it for the love of the people just imagine the orphans they didn't like to be orphans I I have my dad and mom but when I think that if I lose one of them this I lose my mom, just one, and I remain with my dad. I feel like 
I feel like one part is out of me. But imagine someone who don't have a mom, don't have a dad. What kind of life is that? It's really so bad. And so I just want to feel like I want to help those. So those who are dead. And those who are sick, have you ever taken time and visit those people in, who are sick in the hospitals? If you had ever, then you could feel the same as I feel. People are really badly poor, are really badly off, and the condition is really worse. It's just, I don't know. So me and you, what can we do to help these people? It's only coming together. Give anything you have. Anything. You don't mind that me, I have nothing. It can be a book. A book, yes, just a storybook. Give it to someone. Just a storybook. Someone could feel good and comfort. You don't have anything, but you have food. You have a lot of food. We can give food to these people. I've ever gone on the streets and found these people who are just begging begging around these people what can we do as with the youth if you can put on clothes nice nice clothes someone is putting on like rags imagine what do they need what can we do to help those people and to reach them and help them and give the small thing you have even if it's a fruit even if it's a fruit like this one give it to someone Someone will be happy, will be like, yes, someone gave me a few time, will be happy and will be thankful. So it's not about that, but I'm just looking for the trustworthy people who can really help me on this. And this, they can be in Uganda or anywhere else around the world. Thank you so much. And I just wish you a nice day. May God bless you, reward you, whatever you feel like, whatever. Whatever you pray and whatever you deserve, it's uh, a holy month to all the Muslims and to everybody at large. Yeah. So allow me to stop here. Nice day. Next time I'll talk about the more about the organization. What do we have to do, and how to join my organization? It's called Your Voice. Yeah, it's Your Voice. As you hear, it Your Voice. What you speak out. What, what's on your mind what do you think what do you want to do your talents just say it out and everything can be done because there's nothing that will be done when you just quite like what's going to be done nothing but once you speak out and you say out something then something is going to happen so that's why it's called your vice actually i have a lot of a lot of reasons as to why i called it your vice Next time, I'll explain that. But let me, allow me to stop here. Say goodbye to you all. Have a great day. Stay happily. God bless you always. And don't forget to pray. Pray hard to God so that he makes everything possible in your life. To make everything go smoothly to your life. So I love you guys. Thank you so much. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is on Viola Shalita Fresh Girl. And also like my page on Facebook, which is Viola Shalita Fresh Girl. And also you can send me a request on Facebook. I'm using Viola Shalita in bracket Fresh Girl. You can find me on Instagram. No, no, no. On Instagram is as freshgirl.net8 Viola S. Or find me on Twitter as well as Shaita Fresh Girls too. Find me on Snapchat as well as Shaita Fresh Girl. I'm everywhere I'm using my, my name. So let me stop right there. Actually, nice day. Guys, I love you so much. Bye-bye. And I go. Should I? Should I? I just want to leave. <laughs>